Think about yourself as a filmmaker and imagine that you're telling a story in which the film is about a couple and the couple doesn't spend that much time on screen together. The problem that you have to solve is how do I communicate to the audience that these two people who aren't on screen together very much and who may not actually know one another, how do I suggest that they're destined to be together at the end of the film? Director Krzysztof Kieślowski's Red is a unique solution to this kind of problem in suggesting the workings of chance and fate to bring characters together precisely because it relies on a cluster of devices, one of which is camera movement. Kieślowski's Red is the third film in a trilogy that was very loosely inspired by the kinds of values and meanings we associate with the French flag. The first film in the trilogy, Blue, explores themes of liberté. The second film in the trilogy, White, is about égalité. And the third film, Red, explores the value of fraternité. À ma santé. In exploring the theme of fraternity, camera movement becomes a way of suggesting the kinds of connectedness, the unseen bonds that people have with one another. In this case, it's the central couple, but more broadly, it suggests all of the ways in which we as human beings, through our social interactions, through our physical proximity to one another, share a sense and feeling perhaps of brotherhood almost at a kind of existential level.